All right, so now I'm going to show you guys how we can delete files um, in Git. So say um, what I just did is, uh, as you can see here, is I just added a new file called delete2.txt. And I, I've already committed that to my repository. I've already sent it to the publisher. So now if I just do git status, you'll see the only thing it still doesn't recognize is that book three. You know, maybe we'll get around to adding that eventually. Anyway. So let's say I, I want to get rid of that delete2.txt. Maybe I added a file, maybe I added a chapter, and I go, you know, it's just not going to work. That one file, that one chapter, I've decided it's better if I just delete it or something. You know, usually in code, there's just some file, you, you know, okay, it's not needed anymore. So one, one way you can do it is you go into your file directory, and you can just delete it out of here. Maybe you move it to the, the trash bin. Maybe you move it to your recycle bin, you know, depending on if you're on a Mac too. But either way, when you move it from here, you're going to take it from the file directory to the trash bin. Now, when you do that, though, Git doesn't really recognize that. So you need to say, git remove delete to dot text. You need to, you need to tell Git to remove that file as well. Now, when you do that, though, uh, from deleting it from the file directory, the file is technically still saved in your trash bin. So you can recover that file eventually. Now that's one way to do it. The other way to do it is a little more permanent. Let's say I do not go into the file directory. I do not move it out of there. All I do is that command, git remove delete2.txt. That's all I'm going to do. Now, if I do that, it's a hard delete. It's gone forever. There's no recycling, no nothing. It's gone. So I'm going to do that. And it's going to say it removed delete2.txt. Now if I do get status, let's see what it says. It's saying, hey, in your, in your mailbox, we have a message pretty much that says delete2.txt was deleted. Because remember, our publisher still has delete2.txt, and our publisher, publisher still thinks it's a part of the file. So all I have to do is commit this. And I'm going to say deleted delete 2 dot text because we don't need it anymore the commit was made and everything's good so now all we did was pretty much send a package a commit up to the publisher that said forget about delete to dot text it's gone we deleted it so now in future versions it's not going to keep carrying delete to dot text it's going to recognize that file is gone 